Good afternoon, there, kid. What can I help you with? Hello there. I would like to purchase three candy bars. Okay, Donkey. Just take it a browse of this fine booklet, and I think you will find some candy bars that you like it. And all, do you need any fruits and vegetables today? Holy shit, is that a gun in your pocket? You don't look old enough to be carrying that kiddo. How about you just leave my store right now and take your Hershey's chocolate with you and have a fine and handy day. Okay, I will. That was all. Oh my. Whoa. Hair gel. I hear daddy talk about this stuff. He says he wants his hair to be slicky. I'll just slip this in my pocket. Wow. That was easy. What else can I take? Yum. Fresh apples. I've never had one before. Mommy and Daddy always get dried fruit. Now to get out without the store guy seeing me. Hey, where the hell do you think you're going, Sonny? You have to pay for those items you slipped in your pocket. Get back here now or I'll call the authorities. Hey, stop right now! This is the Black Wire Police! You are under arrest for shoplifting, little boy! Hey, excuse me, sir. Can I use your bath? I'm pretty dirty. No, you cannot. Anybody ever inform you of how rude it is to swear? Anybody ever inform you that I don't care? Why are you doing this? I'm not doing anything. I just want a fucking bath, you jerk. Get me a bath now, jerk. Even think about calling the police, old lady. I'll kill you. I mean it. I'll shoot you in your ugly face. Hey, what is this? You get little rascal. Apples and hair gel aren't free. Hey, up boy, I'll beat you to the ground. Come here. Oh, looky here. You have some move, eh? I'll kick your face right into the ground, you pathetic waste of space.
Jesus Christ. Oh my god, I hurt two people and stole hair gel and an apple from the store. Daddy's really gonna kick my ass now. Mikey, you're hardly eating your stew. I went to the store and picked the finest ingredients for dinner. Eat up. Well, this actually tastes better than the slop you usually make. I'm, um, not hungry at the moment. I need to excuse myself, Mommy. Okay, but you're not getting any dried cream dessert. Mikey, come here right now. You're in big trouble. Mikey, did you steal hair gel and an apple from the general store in Blackwater? The mayor sent me a telegram that you apparently robbed the general store and fled in another person's horse carriage. If so, you are going to be grounded for one year. I, 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 I am have to go. Bye. Mikey, get back here right this instant. Mikey, get the back here this instant. Don't make me hag tie you. I'm serious. Stop running now. Ha! Hee 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 hee. Out of places to run now. Time to whoop your ass into its place for once. Oh, go away, Daddy. You'll never take me alive. <laughs> yeah, yeah, stay down, old man. Get... And that's that. Now to get back home. Oh no. What about mommy? She's going to ground me. Little boy, this is the United States Army! Stop right now and we will hurt you! Very spotted! Give him hell voice! Little boy, stop please. We can't talk this through. Don't you say your prayers, son. Right, boys, let's have this little commie demon.
Just use your cock already, boys! Don't be afraid to sue this boy regardless of his age! How the fuck are we gonna win this world war if we can't even power the title? Jack, what have you done? Get your sorry little bottom over here. Jack, you have not only stolen an apple and hair gel from a general store but you beat a gentleman at his house along with killing his mother and choked your father to death in a saloon. You are in deep trouble this time. Why are you giving me that? Oh mommy, I know you are mad but I just wanted fresh fruit to eat and to make daddy happy with hair gel. He always wanted his hair to be soft like you are all the time. Please don't ground me. I'm sorry. I'm nope, really, really, really not sorry. not going to work this time, Mikey. Get on your horse. I bought him along for you to ride home. Oh, and I have no idea why I kept calling you Jack. You look a lot like Jack Marston. That was all. But anyway, you are going to be grounded when we get home and then the police will take you to jail tomorrow for 25 years. Why? Mikey, stop crying this instant. Or I'll convince the police to jail you for 50 years instead and burn all your toys. Now shut it. <laughs>